Hi everyone, I recently bought the OnePlus 3T cell phone to replace my old phone. Now, unfortunately my old phone died basically just because it got abused. I was always dropping it, look, it's bent like a banana, the screen is coming off, there's scuff marks all around it. Because I don't like cell phone cases, I like that it's so thin, it's so slim, it feels good in the hand, you know, it feels good. But then, on my new phone, I thought, you know, it's kind of expensive to buy a new phone. This time I really want to make it last, so I decided to invest in a case from Otterbox. Now the first thing I did was find the official local distributor for Otterbox, contacted them on Facebook and said, do you have the case for the OnePlus 3T? And they said, no. <laughs> so then I just went directly to the Otterbox website, otterbox.asia, and ordered it there. So the case itself is 25 US dollars, and then the delivery by FedEx was $10. And I ordered this three days ago and it arrived today. So that's actually pretty quick, but you are paying $10 for the shipping. So you can see this is an Otterbox case. Now, the nice thing about ordering it through their website is you know you're getting the real deal. Maybe I could find this somewhere at the mall, but how would I know if it's a legitimate one, especially if they're not the official distributor for Otterbox here in the Philippines. So yeah, I'm okay with ordering it online. Yes, it cost me $10 shipping, but at least I I know it's the real deal so let's take a look at what you actually get so it's a two-part case you've got this one here which is a synthetic rubber that goes on the phone first so let me just slip that in and then you've got this piece which is like a hard shell and this is polycarbonate so pretty tough and we just slide our phone in here and there you go, it's now done. And one of the biggest things I was worried about is if this was gonna be bulky, because like I said, that's why I never use a case on any of my old phones, because I hate bulky phones. And I have to say, I'm impressed. Yes, it makes it a tiny bit bulkier, but like, I barely notice it, so I'm happy with the case. Now, one thing to note is that at the moment, I'm just using the screen protector that OnePlus One install. When you buy the phone, it's already installed on the phone, but from what I've read, most of the tempered glass screen protectors you can buy will also work with this case, although I recommend doing your own research first because it would really suck if you bought tempered glass to protect your screen and then found out that it doesn't fit with this case. So do a little bit of research first, but from what I've read, it's pretty good. So what kind of protection do we have? Well, we've got the drop protection because of these nice rubber corners. And then this hard shell protection, I think, I'm not sure here, but maybe that would help with the bending to avoid the banana bend. I'm not sure on that. I really don't know exactly what the hard cover is for other than holding the rubber one in piece. But one thing that I like about it is that look at what it does with the camera. It means that when I put this down on a table, the camera glass isn't against the table and it's not gonna get scratched. Now, I'm a heavy user. I have my phone with me everywhere I go. I'm always taking pictures, videos, replying to tweets, YouTube comments, stuff like that. And I'm always putting my phone down. It might fall off the table. It might slide off a chair. I'm forever dropping my phone. So yes, it's a little bit pricier than other cases, but you know, the phone itself is kind of expensive. So yes, I'm paying $25 plus $10 shipping, so $35 for a case, but hopefully it will keep my phone safe. You know, you can buy a cheap case, but will it offer you the same protection? That's the question. So yeah, just a quick video, but I'm quite happy with my online experience with Otterbox. If you have any questions or suggestions, put them in the comment section down below. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching.